These are two brand new warm audio microphones, the FET U47F and Tube CX12. Designed remakes of some of the greatest microphones ever made, Warm Audio have created a name for themselves when it comes to delivering classic vintage sound at an affordable price. The question surrounding these new microphones though, have Warm Audio done it again? So to kick things off, I would first like to give a huge shout out to Sweetwater for sending me these microphones and for sponsoring today's video. I personally purchase all my studio gear from Sweetwater, so as always, if you're interested in these microphones or any gear for your setup, links can be found in the description below. Now, today I've decided to switch things up a little bit and jump straight into the singing test comparison. Don't worry, we'll dive into the other details later. You and I, we've been at it so long, still got the strongest fire. You and I, we still know how to talk, know how to walk that way. Cause sometimes I feel like the world is against me The sound of your voice, baby, that's what saves me When we're together, I feel so invincible Cause it's us against the world You and me against them all if you're listening to these words, know that we are standing tall. I don't ever see the day that I will catch you when you fall. Cause it's us against the world tonight. I don't ever see the day that I will catch you when you fall Cause it's us against the world tonight I won't ever see the day that I will catch you when you fall Cause it's us against the world Tonight I will never see the day that I will catch you when you fall Cause it's us against the world Tonight Okay, so that is what these two microphones sound like Compared to probably my favorite warm audio microphone, the WA47 For me, both these microphones sound crystal clear With the CX12 being a touch warmer than the WA47F And maybe a little bit brighter than the Tube WA47 When warm audio dropped the CX12 at a similar price to the WA47 The first thing I wanted to do was compare the two and try and spot the differences I mean, the CX12 could well be my new favorite warm audio microphone Both come with the same items in the box including a shock mount, two power unit with nine polar pattern options, same cables and similar wooden case but when I took the CX12 out of the box the first big difference is the vintage case. I mean look at this. The WA47 comes with no case. If you want one it does come at an additional cost and even then it still doesn't look like this and in terms of sound quality they are slightly different too. The CX12 is definitely brighter and maybe even a touch more neutral where the WA47 is warm and soft rounded. Honestly, I don't think the CX12 is my new favorite warm audio microphone right now, but who knows, maybe in the future. And then looking at the new FET microphone challenging two tube classics, the WA47F sounds absolutely fantastic. This microphone is designed to be super versatile for many recording purposes from vocals to drums to a whole bunch of instruments. And I know Andrew Masters tested the WA47F on drums and it sounded so good. And testing it today for vocals, this microphone is just impressive. I did use a WA273 microphone preamp when I recorded the singing test, and this does improve the sound quality of a FET microphone like the WA47F, but even without it, this microphone is worth every penny. 